Hi everybody. I'm back with another journal. This is the Honey Bee themed journal. Um, the book is eight and a half tall by five and a half wide and an inch and a half spine. I have repurposed an old apron drawstring, Swiss dot fabric. It's just very delicate and feminine. It is three signatures. A little book, a library card pocket holds the name of the book, the valuable honeybee. The Plum Creek Booksmith is the author. Some journaling cards that have something to do with bees. And the pages, flowers and bees, and there's butterflies in here too. Lots of journaling space. Lots of sewing and lace. And there's tabs on the top to give it a nice, fun, soft look. I have lots of my own digital um, pages in here and some that I've gotten from other <clears throat> artists online that I've downloaded their work. I love these overall uh, graphics. They just look so delicate. some ledger pages, lots of coffee stained paper, digital stamping, some colored pages, nice center page there with lots of space to write. Some edging. Looks like an old bedspread edge. Decoupaged some Edith Holden paper. Some old lace. Some little flip tabs, tuck spot. like a ladder. This is a little tablet. I titled it Field Notes. Take some extra notes in there and tuck it away. Another journal card that's bee themed. Flash card and another tuck spot.
some Edith Holden paper here from her book. Used it as a corner tuck spot. Some collage. Some more lace. <clears throat> Some more Edith Holden paper from her book. Some butterflies from Edith Holden. Another little journal card with a bunch of bees on some clover it looks like. More room to journal. And that is it. Thanks for looking.